Hello and welcome to Ajay Stromani Guru, your trusted source for the latest updates and advanced analysis on global commodities. Today, we'll be covering two key topics making headlines in the global commodity markets, the surge in China's rapeseed meal imports and Indonesia's latest palm oil production report. Let's dive into the details. Starting with China, the country has experienced a significant rise in rapeseed meal imports from January to September 2024. In September alone, imports reached over 222,000 metric tons, which is an impressive 9.11% increase compared to August and a 25.21% rise year-on-year. For the first nine months of this year, China's total rapeseed meal imports have surged to 2.04 million metric tons. That's a substantial 30.37% increase compared to the same period last year. This growth is driven primarily by imports from Canada, which accounted for a major share, supplying over 70% of China's rapeseed meal imports in September alone. Other significant suppliers include the UAE, Russia, and India. Despite this rise in imports, rapeseed meal prices in China have remained relatively low. The main reason behind this price stability is the abundant supply, with crushes in coastal regions holding ample stocks. While demand remains strong, the availability of large volumes has kept prices from rising sharply. Now, turning our attention to Indonesia, the world's largest palm oil producer. The country reported a slight increase in palm oil production for August 2024, despite earlier challenges posed by dry weather. According to the Indonesian Palm Oil Association, production reached nearly 4 million tons in August, showing a 10.2% increase compared to July. However, when looking at the bigger picture, Indonesia's cumulative palm oil production for the year remains about 5% lower than last year's total. This deep is largely due to the lingering impact of last year's dry weather conditions, which limited overall output. In terms of consumption, domestic use rose slightly in August, while exports saw a notable increase, particularly to India, which imported an additional 170,000 tons compared to the previous month. Pakistan also saw a significant rise in imports. On the other hand, exports to key markets like China, India, and Africa are still down year on year. As of the end of August, Indonesia's palm oil stockpiles dropped to their lowest level since March 2019, reflecting tight supply conditions amid strong demand both domestically and internationally. Despite the recent production recovery, overall output for 2024 is expected to be lower than in previous years, with the total estimated at around 51 million tons, a 5% decline compared to earlier levels. As we move towards the end of the year, both China's rapeseed meal and Indonesia's palm oil sectors will continue to be influenced by shifting demand and supply dynamics. While China's rapeseed meal imports saw amid strong demand, prices remain stable due to ample supply. In Indonesia, despite a slight recovery in production, overall output is expected to stay lower due to last year's weather impacts. That's all for today's update. Stay tuned to Ajayastromani Guru for more in-depth analysis and the latest developments in global commodity markets. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to stay informed.